All right, we're doing a take two because I recorded it with the volume muted. That's fun. I, it was it was a good recording too. It's a it's a shame, a shame that I have to re-record this now. You won't get my first time reactions. It it it's a shame, but it's whatever. Mistakes were made. All right. Uh, so down the dawn, chapter one twenty eight, chapter title: Let's be idols. Very good chapter, but you don't get my first time reaction. It's whatever. Let's just read. Okay, so it starts off with uh, Rin. She's singing. There's like something exploding out of her back or something or other. She's surprised with exclamation points. She's saying May. And there's like a face and it's like biting onto her back or something. And she's struggling under the weight. Ugh. Whatever. Uh, class rep, what's wrong? Why do you stop singing? Says Anyas or whatever her name is. Uh, she's on the ground, kneeling, struggling, d d intense. Uh, oh no! Uh, uh, and then there's like just this big blob, blob thing, on top of her, on top of the float. And then uh, the ombudsman is growing even larger. Not is is the ombudsman the building or the or the blob? Because the, the the building looks about the same size, but that blob on the t float is gigantic. Enormous. I don't know. The big guy's still after us. It says, Psych Psycho? Grandma? What's her name? Psycho? Something like that. Back on your feet. That says Grandma. Um, uh, gah, I can't. Uh, she's pressing down on my back. My voice. Uh, she, uh, we're struggling on the ground. Uh, May, if there's something you want to say to me, then say it. Uh, and then we got, uh, I know you've got a grudge against me, but listen, I have something I want to say to you, and I'm going to double what I have to say back to you. That oh, says Rin. Uh, we're inside of it, says the Grandma. Uh, we're inside of the scene of the accident. Okay, we got bird's eye view heading towards the, the city the place. Uh, once we reach it, the ombudsman's memories from before it became an evil spirit should be revived. So they're like cleansing the evil spirit or whatever by going to the um, accident point, I guess. We need to hold out until we get there. Uh, and then there's the big action scene with the statue guys running, jumping, and uh, Anya's holding the shield, Grandma up top doing stuff. Maybe somebody in the window, I can't tell. Uh, we need to hold on until we get there. There's no way there. So many. <clears throat> okay. Then we got, there's a statue guy who's going to jump on the float, but then Okaroon comes out of nowhere and just drop kicks him at high speeds. And uh, Anya says, like, whoa. She says, whoa. Uh, nice one, uh, Okaroon. Uh, but what's pulling the float? The law of inertia. Um, says Okarun. Um, indeed. Uh, I will kill you, says, uh, the, the ghost latching onto the, uh, Rin's back. Wait. Uh, presumably says Rin with exclamation points. I'm coming with you. Uh, in a flashback, they're at, like, uh, auditions for idols or whatever. Uh, you can't. Uh, May, you wait out here with your friends. I'll go pick up Rin and come back. Yeah. Says their, I don't know, teacher or whatever. If they call your name, you go on in without me. You'll be fine. Just hold your head up high. No, I just have to come to, says May, as a child. I have to apologize to Rin. I, I said so much horrible things to her. She says with tears in her eyes. Now she's in the back of a vehicle looking out the window. Um, I couldn't understand how tough she had it pushing uh, her grandma in a wheelchair. Rin is. I can't stand by her side as things stand now. Uh, how can I be her friend and get Rin looking uh, surprised? Well, and then there's the uh, the part where um, May, her ghost friend, kind of manifests and looks. She's looking very angelic. 
Uh, and then she's facing Rin, and they're both got tears in their eyes, and they're it's sad, emotional. I remember now the thing I wanted to tell you all this time. Um, says uh, hey, I'm sorry. We uh can be friends? Question mark. Oh, of course we can. Uh, uh, Rin says well emotionally and apparently unable to speak. Um, properly. Um, uh, and then they're both happy crying, facing each other after the big emotional hug they shared. Um, and then it's looking all like Mad Max with big trucks and with spikes and, uh, statue guys hopping around and getting beat back by the crew of the float. Oh no, the float's falling apart. Rin, hurry up and sing. At this rate, we won't be able to make it to the audition venue, says Grandma. May, can't you do anything about that big one? It's being drawn by you, isn't it? Uh, sorry, there's nothing I can do about it myself. Huh? I'll be okay. Uh, we've got your song. We can sing it together, offers uh, May. And uh, 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 Rin is happy looking. They, they grab the uh, the microphone. And just, Let's do this. And then they're striking the idol pose and they're about to sing. And then it's a giant shockwave, seemingly destroying everything. Though, as we know, it's when there's destruction, it's there's actually not destruction. It's, I I forget how it works, but like none of the none of this destruction is actually happening. So it's it's fine. Tons of buildings seemingly being destroyed, but nope. We'll all go back to normal after the fight. And then they're striking their idle poses with the Spider-Man finger peace sign or whatever it is. Um, and then they're approaching the the, the audition venue, and uh, the they collapse right at the venue. Huff huff, we made it. Couldn't last another second. Huff huff, May. Uh, where are you? Um. She spots me off in the distance towards the audition venue with like little particles like she's fading away and more particles with her fading away at the uh, zoom in to see her. And May, singing and dancing with you was so much fun. I wasn't lying when I said I wanted to be idols together. Uh, and then um, <clears throat> her friend May is looking down sad. Rin, the thing is, I was envious of you. Uh, and then they're um, speaking, but they look like their child selves. Uh, you always seem to so nervous, but when you're saying you were so dignified, like you had uh, no doubts at all. But I am different. I was always so anxious, worrying that people might not like me, um, says her friend May. <clears throat> I had no self-confidence. Uh, being an idol was something to make my mom happy. I was just trying to live up to her expectations, so I'm the real traitor. I think this is all May speaking. And there's a flashback with them, uh, May and Rin and their friends uh, in like a field or something? Hard to tell. Um, then we got the back of uh, Rin's head as a child. Uh, no, me, you're not a traitor. You were always kind to all of us. And you were bright and cheerful. You were an idol to us all. And we all admired you. And they're all children. And it's, 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 um... Okay. Next page. We got, uh, they're doing idol poses with the Spider-Man fingers. But that wasn't just because you were so sweet. You were so desperately trying to meet expectations. And there's another um, panel where they're doing idle poses with the, uh, yup. And then giving it everything you had. And you got uh, Rin as a child crying, looking so cool, that's why. And then you got uh, May fading away like she's been Thanos snapped. Um, crying uh and then next page is like rin or, or me i guess all all faded away and nowhere inside just still some particles of her floating away and you got 
Rin, super sad. Tears in her eyes, streaming down her cheeks. Uh, biting her lip, holding back the emotions. Uh, and then got Grandma smoking a cigarette. Grandma turns around, puts a hand on her shoulder to comfort her. She's wiping away her tears. Um, and then final page. Uh, it's all of them. Rin and me and all their friends, uh, as children, just uh, running around having fun. This is to be continued. So yeah, very good chapter. I wish I could have uh, had my initial reaction, but uh, this will have to suffice uh, since I messed up and forgot to unmute. Anyways, um, very good chapter. Um, additional notes is I would like to add that uh, these chapters where they do backstories are probably some of my favorite chapters in this manga. Like The backstories are always like really well done. I love their backstories. Um, for all the characters, this one was especially, especially good, very emotional, very, uh, touching, heartwarming, very sweet, you know, very sad with the, you know, all that good stuff. Anyways, um, that's the chapter, very good chapter.